In the news today, former X-Men star James Marsden says he would like to come back in the MCU and play Cyclops again. What do you think about that? I think James Marsden, I love James Marsden. I'm going to go ahead and just say, I in, in Westworld, mm-hmm. I've been enjoying him in Westworld. I think he's great. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't have anything against James Marsden. Um, he's a great actor, whatever. He, he does some good stuff. I'm into it. Um, no. Fuck you. No. You're not playing Cyclops. Fuck. Shut up. Uh, Sit down. A, you're too old by now. B, no. Nobody's asking for you to come back. You did a shitty job in the role. It wasn't his fault. I don't think it was his fault. It wasn't his fault, but it was still just like nobody wants to be reminded of that fucking loser. So, no. What he about, can shut up and no. What about I the love nacho him, but fries. no. Have you seen him in the nacho fries commercial? <laughs> yeah, he's in a nacho fry commercial. They're actually really funny. They make me laugh like every time I see them. Uh, well, nacho fries for who? Taco it's, Bell? Yeah, but it's like they're like really like deadly serious. Daddy, it's supposed to be like this apocalyptic me. scenario and he's like playing the lead. Uh huh. Chaos unfolds as Taco Bell's beloved nacho fries vanish yet again. Sir, we need you to come with us. Daddy? Go back inside, honey. Dr. Conrad, thank you for coming. This kind of deliciousness doesn't just disappear. Where did you go? What if they were in a different space-time continuum? Another dimension? There are fries. The season it's like, but it's spices. about fries. I'm into it. I mean, they're I'll really watch funny. It. They're, I mean, they're very funny. Daddy's gonna bring Show fries. I'm, you know, it's, I was to say, like, Marston is cool. Like, I'm, I'm down with Marston, but not for this. And no, and nobody asked. Nobody wants it. Sit down. Go find something else to do. Yeah. This is not it. This is not it for you. Uh, but I, I love you, James. I love you, James. Just no, you're not Scott. It's not. No, it's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Is next. Thank you. Next. <laughs> thank but you. But you know what would work? Next. <laughs> what would work? Who? It's Pendico. Oh, Pendico. Pendico, Pendico works little. every time you use it, right? Holy shit. Uh, every time. Every time you use it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Pendico <laughs> is, if you haven't heard by now <laughs> on all of our, all our ads here. Uh, they what, make, what is Pendico? It's my first time. Fuck. Are you kidding me? Um, I want that song to play. If you don't know by now. You know? <laughs> yeah. That one? Like... <laughs> You don't know that song. I don't know the. Um, yeah. <laughs> if you or if wow, it's a hard one to sing. Yeah. You don't know by now. <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah. I know. I know. Yeah. Right. You're gonna get banned. Um, yeah. So if you don't know, is a natural <laughs> you don't know by now. CBD product, right? Yeah. Is it? Tyson, what is this product? What is it? What is Bendico? A natural CBD product. A CBD. What is that? I was hoping you could tell the audience what CBD is. Um. CBD is a non-psychoactive component in marijuana. Yeah, it is. Did I get that right? You did. You did. <laughs> <laughs> I live for these ads, Comic yeah. Cold. Uh, okay, fuck. I guess we're doing it again. Um, so, What's I know. What's that? What are we looking at? There? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, that? I'm on the struggle bus. Okay. Wait, were those cold? Oh, All right, God. let's try this one I'm more time. I'm a little struggle. <laughs> okay, I'm on the go. struggle bus. I mean, Ready and... <laughs> but you know what does work well is Pendico. Yeah, it works every time, uh, all the time. My favorite Pendico ad, personally, is the uh, the chapstick. I'm all about the CBD chapstick. Your favorite Pendico ad. Your favorite ad. No, the fuck. See, that's why. <laughs> see, I'm not. Even, I don't. I'm on the struggle bus. Okay, I'm on my period. I don't care. I, I just like. I don't want. Like, I don't want to do this. Like, I don't want to do this. All I right, think no, you're this doing is. Great. It's okay. I think this is stupid. To, Wait a like, minute. I, Whoa. No, no, not Pendico. Not Pendico. Just Whoa, like okay, no. Cut, cut. No, no, no. All right, take three. Okay. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> CBD tampons. <laughs> Yeah, when they have one, some of those, <laughs> call me, you know, like, call me. Okay, so, Can you, just... you know what does work really well is Pendico. Yes, Pendico works so great. It is a CBD company where they're infusing CBD in all sorts of awesome products, such as incense, candles, pain and muscle rubs, uh, chapsticks, my mm-hmm. personal favorite, bath bombs. Love the bath bombs. These are great, too. I will say, as somebody, I don't know if you're into... Um, if you guys are into um, incense or not, but their incense is really, it, it burns really well and it's like, it's nice. It's not a crappy incense. It's a good, it's, 
And, uh, I've been burning the Pendico incense at my place, and it lasts for a really long time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's no, very it's powerful, much more powerful than normal incense. I've been yeah, using. I mean the regular incense that we buy is not like this. Is really the sticks are really coated with the incense. Mm. Like it's a really nice smelling situation here. It's like pretty. It's pretty thick, as they say, as the kids say. So it's like a nice. And this one's definitely a little thicker. So yeah. Anyways, so here you go. So, in incest, no incense, guys. In incense. Yeah, yeah. Um, we want to make sure we make that distinction. Pendico make that... does not sell or promote incest. <laughs> it does not. Sell. Incense. 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 Um, so yeah, you can go to pendy.co if you want to order some. And there's a discount code if, if you use CBG19. Yes. Then. Great. Great HBO job. sure sells incest. That's funny, Bryce Surratt. It's a good one. There's incest in Game of Thrones. Oh, yeah. By the way, next Sunday is the premiere of season eight. What do you think yeah. about that? Whoa. Um, so. Um, Are you excited about the show? I am. Yeah, I'm excited. I feel like I, I'm glad that I got that break because I was like kind yeah. of like over it. But now that I've had a break for, and it's been like two years, <laughs> like I'm ready to get back into it and mm. I'm excited for it. So I am excited for it. We'll definitely be talking about the first episode next week uh, to some degree, I'm sure. So. Mm. Uh, Great. Yeah, we're looking forward to it. Cool. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm sure a lot of people are looking forward to that. Yeah. Yeah. It's uh, it's gonna be a good time. It's gonna be a good time. It's good times for everybody. <laughs> uh, any other any other movie news that we have going on? Uh, that's uh, that's it. That's it. Haven't seen Shazam. Not gonna see Pet Cemetery. We missed Shazam. Uh. Yeah. Y'all are asking about the Cowboy Bebop news. Um. What's the Cowboy Bebop news? Well, they're gonna make a live action series for Netflix. People are excited. It's probably going to suck like every an- live action anime adaptation that we've seen. I mean, I don't, I don't, have we ever, is there a good live action anime adaptation out there that is, re- is, is there a good one? Because I've yet to see it. I can't think of anything. Can you think of anything, Jay? No, I'm, no. I can't think of one that was like, that came out that was good. Yeah. And, uh, and like, at first I was like, oh, John chose a good choice. Okay. But then like, you were like, wait, how old is he? And we looked up how old he is and he's old as fuck. He's way too old for this role. Yeah. Uh, he's just, he's not, he's a little old for this role. Maybe. So. He's, he's on the screen. You know? Well, yeah. I mean, that's, that's great. He's cool. I have nothing. I have no problems with John Cho. I think he's great. Yeah. You know? Maybe I, it takes place in the future maybe <laughs> maybe it's like maybe but i mean he i feel like he's gonna be older than than what's up the guy with the chops what's his name yeah jet black yeah he's gonna be older than like jet because like I, it's like look spike not yeah. older than jet yo so i don't know we'll see um here you go on screen so does that help him? uh yeah. yeah yeah um who the fuck is that other guy supposed to be on the end there it's supposed to be ed Who's no. that supposed to be? <laughs> Who's that supposed to be? Is that Ayn? <laughs> Ayn doesn't talk, so I don't know what he would do. Um, John isn't cute enough for me. He isn't cute enough, too. Spike's kind of supposed to be a cutie. You know? I mean, he's all right, but he's not, like, cutie. Cutie status. We'll see. Oh, he's yeah. vicious. That guy's vicious. Okay, so they're doing. Okay.